Welcome to this new cycle of learning. Today we are going to be doing some chaining. Materials! Today you will need to grab a piece of paper and a pencil. You can get your things ready and let's get started. Here are today's learning targets. I can segment and blend CCV words with the sounds W, I, F, and O. I can write the letters that match the sounds W, H, Y, F, L, and I. And finally, I can read and spell VC and CCV words with the sounds W, S, O, the long I, Y, M, and R. Transition song. Sit down and come together, together, together. Sit down and come together, together right now. It's time to make three sounds and blend them together. Let's listen to each sound now and blend them to make a word. Word work. Now, we are going to make some words using the sounds that we know. Listen while I read this first one. The word is cry. K, er, I, cry. Did you hear all three sounds? Tap out the word cry and blend the sounds with me. Here we go. K, er, I, cry. Great job. Take a look at our next word. Look closely at the first letter, middle letter, and ending letter. Hmm, what sounds do those letters make? The sounds in our next word are f, o, i. What word do those three sounds make? Mm hmm, fly. Tap it out and blend the sounds with me this time. F, o, i, fly. You'll notice that the word fly and cry have a Y at the end. That Y is being sly because it is making the long I sound at the end of those words. The Y does that when it comes at the end of a consonant vowel or consonant consonant vowel word. We will do a lot of work this week reading and writing words that have the sly Y at the end. Transition song. Now it's time to match these sounds to their letters and write them. Now it's time to match these sounds to their letters. Let's go. Writing. Now you will write the letters that match the sounds that you hear. This will help you become stronger at writing words. Let's start with the word sly. S-l-i, sly. What sound do you hear at the end of the word sly? Mm-hmm. The Y says I. Now, let's write the word sly on your paper. Starting with that letter S, just under the middle line. Pull in, around, and back around. For the lowercase l, starting at the top line, just pull down. And finally, for that lowercase y, start at the middle line. Slant in, and then slant and down. 
Excellent work. You just wrote the word sly. Let's tap that word out one more time, listening for each of the three sounds. S, O, I, sly. Now, let's try the word cry. K, R, I, cry. You'll notice that that letter Y at the end says I. Now, let's write the word cry. Start with that magic C. Just under the dotted line, pull it back and around. For that lowercase r, pull down, up, and over. And then the Y. Slant in, slant, and down. Great job writing the word cry. Let's tap it out one more time. K, R, I, cry. Now, I am going to tap out the sounds in this next word. Then see if you can decode them. M, mm, I. What is that word? Mm-hmm, my. Go ahead and write the word my on your paper. That letter M starts at the middle line. Pull down, up, over, make a hump, up, over, make a hump. And the letter Y, slant in, slant, and down. Now that you've written the word my, let's tap it out one more time and blend the sounds together. M, I, my. Now take a look at our next word. What has changed? That's right, the M has disappeared and it was replaced with the WH. WH is a digraph. The W and H work together to say W. Try that with me. W. What has stayed the same in this word? Mm-hmm. The Y is there. It still says I. Can you decode this new word? Go ahead and try. Let's do it together. W, I, Y. Go ahead and write the word Y on your piece of paper. For that lowercase w, start at the middle line. Slant in and up, slant in and up. The H, pull, pull down, up, over, make a hump. And then the Y. Slant in, slant, and down. Let's tap this word out one more time. W, I, Y. Excellent work writing all of those words with that sly Y at the end. Closing reflection. It's always a good idea to pause and celebrate and reflect on our learning. How does chaining help you to form new words? As you work this week, continue to match letters to sounds and then write them to form new words. It's going to be an exciting cycle of learning and working with that sly why. I can't wait to continue our work together next time. <laughs>